Hi guys, welcome to our channel. This is our fourth video in the series of Simulink modeling. We know how to generate a basic signal from the available blocks. But how to generate a signal something like this? We will know that now. It's a combination of different signals. A step signal starting at origin. A step signal with a delay of 3. Also a ramp signal starting at 3, but with a slope of 2 thirds as it changes two units vertically with a movement of three units horizontally. And we have some other signals combined at given time units. If we write an expression for the signal, we get it like this. 2ut plus, 2ut minus 3 plus, 2 thirds rt minus 3, 4 thirds rt minus 6, plus 2 thirds rt minus 9, ut minus 9, minus 2ut minus 12. So our final expression. Let's generate it in Simulink. Now open Simulink. Click on Simulink Library Browser. Go to Sources and drag the Step Signal block. Now get the scope from the sinks. Connect them. We observe the step source, it's starting at 1. Run the model. We got a step signal at 1 position. Because we give 1 here, the step occurs at 1. Make it zero and run the model again. Here we get the step at zero. We can't observe it clearly. Now add the gain block here to get the amplitude of two. Or we can directly change it at the source block. We can observe it here. Now add a ramp signal also. Yup we got the ramp signal starting from 0 with a slope of 1. Now search for the add block and connect these signal to it. Connect it to scope. Run the model. We got the resultant signal here. We got the ramp signal initially then we add a step signal after one unit time. Now clear these. If we want to delay the signal how to do that? Open continuous blocks. Here we have this variable time delay block. Drag this. We give the amount of delay using constant block. Now connect the signals to scope. Run the model. We get the delay in the signal. But we got this, that's completely fine. Now get the add block and connect the signals. Change these values as we need in our equation. Connect it to scope and run the model. Similarly put some gain to the ramp signal also. Add the delay to the amplified signal. Now also add the remaining blocks which we need in our equation. Change this delay values accordingly. Add more points to the add block to connect more signals. Make the connections. Run the model. Oops we lost it somewhere. It is because of the start time of the step signal is 1. Make it to 0. Yup we got it. Now add the remaining blocks also.
make the connections. Run the model. Increase the run time. Oops, we got something different here. That is because of the delay here. Here the maximum delay is 10. But we need greater than that. So increase it. Now run the model. Yup we got it. So this is our final model to generate our desired signal. Can we create this without using these delay blocks? Yes we can. But how to do that? Try that on your own. Answer to this question will be revealed in our next video.